Yeah, we went to the same, the Manchester school, and it was, uh, we had the four grades in one part of the room and four in the other, just like with Merle. Uh, the teacher names, I can remember some of them that won't go into the names of the teachers, but we had a lot of little tricks played in the, in the grade school. Uh, Kent and others, they'd go out and catch a gopher and just for, it didn't hurt anybody, but when the teacher wasn't right at the desk, it seemed to be like a gopher or two would be put in the, in, in the door and in, in the desk. <laughs> uh, and the teacher opened the door eventually in there and, whoa, <laughs> who did it? <laughs> She'd raise heck trying to find out, but I don't know if she ever found out for sure who did it. But, Probably yeah. one of the Blackburn boys. Well, it had to be because the more Blackburns than anything, <laughs> we ruled. <laughs> but that, uh, that school on the ground was an acre of land, I guess. And uh, well, I don't know, it was just a lot of good teaching. We had good teachers. and, and yeah, like, They were well, dedicated. Yeah. yeah they, were, they were good. We all had always good teachers. At least, I think, so later years because mm -hmm. we'd learn to write and we can read the writing. And, yeah. <laughs> Uh, today it's uh, quite a bit different as far as I'm concerned. But, uh, oh, one time I, I remember Miss Longton, she was kind of, she got disturbed really easy and Kent and Henry McDonough, I think, brought a saw to school and they wanted to make some noise and uh, play that saw. <laughs> and she went out to the bathroom or somewhere and Kent, I think it was Kent, pulled that out and started playing it. It's supposed to be music on that saw. <laughs> yeah, there is good music comes out you of that can, saw. Yeah. And she come and she just raised Cain. We was right. supposed to be doing studying and <clears throat> not take, taking advantage of her while she's out uh, doing her thing or whatever. <laughs> uh, it wasn't much comic to the school. But it was, I enjoyed the grade school, but the high school, no. And it was just like you, a new new bunch, and they had their groups formed. And, it wasn't at a picnic going to school, in school, in high Great Falls. Yeah, pretty challenging. But I started out and <coughs> I was running the, the dairy truck. And Betty was a senior and I was a freshman and I'd take her to high school about time it would start for her and then I got my class at range so I'd come in an hour and a half or so later and I'd finish the milk route and then I'd go in and uh, missed a class or two, but sometimes they have to make it up after a little later, stay a little later. And, but she was just to graduate, and I just started, and I had an awful time. I got a credit and a half that year. I, <laughs> I went the whole year and got me a yearbook, and, <laughs> but I I hated school. I just in great falls. Did you like work. school before that, though? Oh, the grade school. I I enjoyed it. Yeah, it, we had good teachers, and I, I we was there for reason. We didn't have far to go, and. It's kind of nice. And they sometimes tell us if we get our work done in the morning, we could go on a picnic in the afternoon. And yeah. So we had a lot of fun things to look forward to. Yeah, and we go from one school to the other different times and uh, put on contests for high jumping and, uh, and broad jumping. And what all. other schools did you go oh, to? We go to Cascade and I don't remember, I think maybe Sims, different mm -hmm. surrounding schools. And, and that's where I met my first love was in Grade school. Oh, yeah, <laughs> me too. And who was Did that? Uh, Virginia Thrillkill. Uh, she was uh, quite a bit older than me. I, was, I could still stand up in her car behind her seat. <laughs> <laughs> and I'd get in that back and I'd stand there and I, as soon as she'd get there, I'd put my arms around her. Now, I don't know if that love or not, but I was, uh, no. <laughs> but I always thought about that and uh -huh. uh, how good natured she was to allow me to. You just put my arms on her. <laughs> yeah. That was a, that's quite a thrill. And then we go to the track meetings where we would have them and come back. I'd be in the same position coming back. I, I like Miss Elko. <laughs> yeah. Well, I remember having some of those competitions. Yeah. But I, for some reason, can't remember going to other schools. Oh. No. I remember having them there with other kids coming there to our school. Well, we don't, I don't remember them coming there. I remember one time there was a track meet and we were having a, in the high jump contest, someone had either put a snake under the bar or it happened to crawl there and and 
when I went to jump, there was all of a sudden when I went to jump, there was a big <laughs> snake. I can't remember if it was a rattlesnake or a big bull snake right under the bar, and somehow and that made me clear the bar. <laughs> that's about the only thing I remember about track meets. I remember playing pump pump pull away the games we used to play. Pump pump pull away and Annie I over. Yeah, over all, school. until we had them them days of those silly games. Can you explain those games? Pump pump pull away. You yeah. uh, divide into two lines of. <laughs> Kids, I don't know how we chose up sides, but I think one person, you pick two people to choose, and then we have two lines of kids, and you would, uh, I, there's probably other details, but I remember one group would try to run through that group, and then try to not get caught, and then the other group would try to run through yours. There's got to be more to it than that. But really? Something about running through, through and not getting caught, and others would, <laughs> would catch it. <laughs> I know how we'd kind of decide who was going to be a, who, uh -huh. with who, would, the teacher would have a baseball bat or oh, yeah. and throw it and the one of us would catch it and then the, the other like their that. hand like this and, uh -huh. and the <laughs> one last on top, the little hand got, first. got to be, or is that or got to be the leader. Uh-huh, maybe so, yeah. <laughs> what was the other game? And the eye over, the yeah. ball over the, over the school or over a house or oh, wherever you so were. So many going. kids on this side and so many on this side. Oh, and you get points if you catch it because you never knew where it was going to oh. come. And just, it was blind throwing it over knowing there's kids on the other side. And it was kind of like hitting 500, you know, and people trying to catch the ball and you get points if you could catch it. Uh -huh. so. And that the pump, pump, pull away was, we call it a pump, pump, pull away. If you don't come, I'll pull you Oh, away. you're right, yeah. <laughs> uh, I knew there was more to it. Yeah. That was so fun. I don't, we do that for a little hours, it seems like. <laughs>